Former local standout athlete who was arrested for what police call a brazen home invasion. Derek Crockett ran track, he played football and basketball for Salem's McKay High School. He went on to play football at a Bay Area college, but one time, the one time athlete of the week now faces several felony charges for the suspected crime spree. Our Jennifer Hoff is in the newsroom with his Coin Six exclusive. Dan, police say over summer, Dierk broke into a California house and with an accomplice held two people inside it at gunpoint and then used the victim's debit, debit card in several cities. These are just accusations his aunt tells me have shocked the family. Nobody suspect anything like this to happen. Inside her Salem living room, I told De'Ara Crockett's aunt the details about crimes the once star athlete is accused of committing. The only thing I can do now is uh, call and try and tell somebody what you told me. I'm Allison And then, then some of, at least I'll know something now. And the rest of them, they just been all stressed out and worried. You know, trying to figure out what the heck happened. I found out police arrested Crockett two weeks ago in Salem for an August home invasion in Alameda County, California. He and another man were wanted for breaking into this house, holding two people at gunpoint, emptying a safe, and stealing the victim's bank account information. Police asked for the public's help to identify the suspects and release surveillance photos that showed them using debit cards at five ATMs throughout the South Bay. He's never been in trouble here. That's what I'm saying. This is, this is a shock to everybody. In fact, the 24-year-old was a standout high school athlete who would go on to play defensive back at Foothill College in California. I found this video of number four on a website with an option for recruiters to contact him. It says Crockett was class of 2014 and very well could have graduated from college weeks before the crime spree. Well, I don't know how he got in this mess, but all I can do is pray and hope they can get out of it. I found out Crockett is in the Marion County Jail and waived extradition to California. He may be to that state by the beginning of January where he faces six charges. While that other suspect was arrested in California, he has not been charged yet in this case. I'm waiting to hear back from Crockett's former coaches for more information and we'll let you know when and if I learn any more, Dan. So tough for everybody who knew him. Thank you, Jen.